Hey everyone, Silicat2 here. Are you ready for bonus content? I know I am! Let's start with this guy. Remember how I said not to use Douse on the Pink Tornado? Well, I am going to use Douse on the Pink Tornado. This is the Tempest Lizard. He has 3000 HP, 45 PP, and is weak against Earth. His attacks include Wing Stroke, Sonic Slash, Storm Ray, Tempest, Impact, and Ward. That being said, we're going to have Isaac attack. He is actually not that different from the Tornado Lizard, if my source is correct. So, I don't know why I bothered saying that this guy was tough, because he's not, really. Just keep attacking. That's all. At his wing stroke, it is a wind elemental attack that targets three people. I don't know. I'm not really seeing a problem here. Sonic Slash, that's a synergy that Jupiter Adepts can learn sometimes with certain classes, and... Okay, I guess he's a little tough in that he takes two turns per round of combat, but... Well, we have Mia. We don't really need to worry about anything else. He will die, eventually. Impact we've seen. And there we go. He has a 100% chance of dropping a potion. Good to know. Now, you may be wondering, oh no, we can't get to Crossbow Nile now that we've killed him. Well... I GUESS YOU'RE RIGHT! <laughs> uh... Actually, no. If you save your game and... Reset... Um, why is he still gone? Do I have to leave the desert and come back? It's gonna take forever. Two enemies that I don't think we've ever encountered, the Roach and the Harrigan. I don't know how we missed these two. But I honestly didn't think we'd be fighting them in this episode, so I didn't bother to prepare bios for them. Uh, Okay, let's leave, re-enter, get into a random encounter. See, it's back. Um, bring Bart. <laughs> Yeah, once you kill the, uh, Tornado Lizard, it goes away forever. Alright, let's let this guy take us to Crossbow Nile now.
This is why Matthew is better than Isaac. He already knows growth. But anyway, let's head further into Crossbone Isle now. Like so. Oops. Uh, nothing. Meet the Earth Lizards! They are weak to Jupiter and strong against Venus, so... Well, let's just summon rush them as always. They have 1,550 HP each and 48 PP each. They will always drop a water of life when you beat them. These are the only two Earth Lizards in the game. Their skills include Acid Breath, which is a multi-targeting Mars elemental attack. And their synergy include Quake Spot, <laughs> Clay Spire, Quake Sphere, Mother Gaia, and Cure Well, which are all attacks that Isaac knows. Yeah. That's really all. We don't have to worry too much about them. The summoning should take care of them all. I'm going to drop a meteor on your head. Okay, I guess it didn't quite take care of them, but yeah, these guys are a piece of cake no matter what. Unless they kill Ivan. That was not supposed to happen. Sure, as soon as I prepare for a battle, I start sucking. Yeah, yeah, gear, quick sphere. She like here. And that is that. See? Water of Life. Alright, now, this floor has the carry puzzles from Venus Lighthouse. Oh, joy. Oops. <laughs> that was probably the stupidest thing I have ever done. I pushed a block off the pit, off the cliff. Seriously. I'm so stupid. Got a Psy Crystal, that's good. We might need those if Mia starts running out of PP again like she did in the Fusion Dragon fight. What am I supposed to do now? Oh, pfft, duh. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I'm supposed to leave and come back because I stupidly did stupid stuff. And yeah, if you solve the puzzles in the wrong order, you're screwed. Oh look, 777 coins. I must be super lucky. I cannot come back that way. So I must go around, go around, go around, go around, go around, go around! Stupid door.
check the chest. That is a gable looking metal to Ivan. Come back, go out, come back, go out, come back. Does it ever end? No. Actually, go here now. I think about it. <laughs> Wicked mace. That is definitely a cursed item, so I would stay away from it unless you plan on selling it. Next up is the Poison Toad. It is accompanied by two Thunder Lizards, which we have already seen. It is weak to Mars, strong to Mercury, and it has no Synergy. 2,250 HP each. Or, rather, it has 2,250 HP. Its skills are Rabid Fang, Acid Blessing, and Rotten Blood. It has a 100% chance of dropping Water of Life. That being said, let's kill it like we've killed all the other mini-bosses so far. That is Acid Blessing. Who mastered what just now, but uh, whatever. <laughs> okay, this place. Potion. Um. Wait... I'm stupid. Why are you being so 
so stupid today? Why? Cleric's ring. Eight hundred eighty-eight coins. And with that, I guess it's a. Eh, you know what? I can get one more episode. Or one more level in. up is Cerberus, not Cerebus, Cerberus. Get your English translations right, count a lot. Anyway, he is weak to Mars, which is why I put all of Garrett's gin on standby. They are strong against water. Their skills include Double Fang, Ice Blessing, and Wicked Howl, which we have all seen. They have the Restore Synergy and Ice Missile. Ice Missile is an upgraded form of Mia's Ice Horn. They have 2,200 HP each and 42 PP each, and they drop a Psy Crystal. Not bad. Please die. Whoa. Okay, we've taken out the first one. Okay, we got him. Oh no, log rolling puzzles hard. Ninety-nine coins. Sleep bomb. Water of life.
Whoops, no. That should do the trick. Muramasa. See? Cursed. Cursed. And I guess that will be it for this episode. Next up, we're fighting the big man who has the rock. <laughs>